showed the speaker uh, at, the, uh, at the Consumer Electronics Show for the first time in January of 1982. Dave uh, Wilson and uh, Krell had a room together and uh, we used the, the Wham and it was a debut for my new amplifier. He had been working on this really big amplifier which would become the KMA 200 monoblocks. And uh, so he said, yeah, why don't you use a pair of those uh, for, your, for your Whams? So we did, and uh, I think it really helped the presentation of that speaker. The show was a great success for us, and, and I recall that, and, and I appreciated that. So, you know, fast forward to the time, and here we are in 2010 to 2011, and, uh, and lo and behold, it's Dan's turn to be introducing his product at a, a very important product introduction at Consumer Electronics Show. Dan, how are you? You're doing well. Well, I've only seen photographs of this, which do not do it justice. It represents uh, probably more of what Dan is capable of doing in amplifier design. Uh, it's like starting with a fresh sheet, but with decades of experience. I tried to take some of the things that I have done in the past and, uh, and melt them into something brand new. So I wanted to make something that was built like a watch inside and out, had the performance window of an extremely large amplifier, but in a very small, compact, and beautiful looking enclosure. I poured my heart into building it and, and into the circuits, the design of it, and even the packaging of it. Before the CES show, uh, we uh, kind of thought long and hard about what speaker we would debut with. I kind of thought about uh, the nostalgic part of it and the fact that, that I've heard some really wonderful things about the Sasha, so I, I called Dave and asked him if I could, could hear a pair, and he sent them to me, and uh, we, were, we, were, we were flabbergasted at how good it was. Because I was happy. I didn't want you to see. I was afraid of sex mystery and of losing. I did a similar thing that he did, I and mean, I put everything I knew into this little, little box, and. He kind of did the same thing and then listened to them together. The, the experience is really uh, gives me goosebumps. I think the pairing is uh, it, it's astonishingly good. It's a very, very, very good sound. 35.